What's up, y'all? I'm Kevin Cheek Guitar, and I'm back with another video. And in today's lesson, we're going to dive a little deeper into the major scale. Um, if you haven't checked out my previous major scale video, go check it out right now. Link will be in the description. Um, make sure you like and subscribe. Comment on the video. Let me know if this is helping you um, as far as learning guitar and some chords and progressions and scales. <coughs> So today we're going to be in the key of G flat. And we're going to play the first, the second, the third, fourth, fifth, and sixth degree of the major scale. So it'll be this. But instead of playing those notes, we're going to play the chords first one we're going to play a major seven chord because the one is major then we're going to go to the two which is a minor seven because the two the second degree is minor the third degree is also minor the fourth degree is major The fifth degree is major, and the sixth degree is minor. But we're not going to play it straight one, two, three, four, five, six. We're going to skip. We're going to start on the one, then we're going to go to the four, which is directly under the one. So where that G flat is, we're going to go to the fifth string and play a major seven chord so one two to four then from that four we're going to go to the two which is a minor chord so four two then from the two we're going to go to the five so that's a minor, which is the two. We're going to go to the major, which is five. And from that five, we're going to go to the three. Five, three. So major to the minor. Then from that three, we're going to go to the six. Once again. Starting on the G flat, major chord, one, four, two, five, three, six. And see how it sounds a little more musical? And that's what I like about that. One, four, two, five, three, six and I also like you don't have to start on the one what if you want to start on the four major seven chord then go to the six then go to the five then back to the four that's a progression right there four six five four or what if we want to start on that six let's go six five four Six, three, then to the two. Ready? And 
that's the six three two now let's go two three six <laughs> This time, let's try two, five, one. Two, five, one. Two, one. Two, five, one. Now, this time we're going to go two, five, one, four. Let's see what that sounds like. Think it'll work? Let's see. Two, five, one, four. Mm, sounds all right to me. So you can come up with endless progressions just mixing the first six notes of the major scale and come up with some progressions that you can write some songs to or if you just want to practice your chords um, moving your chords instead of just going from one two three four five six you can move them around and i suggest moving them around um how i first showed you one then go directly under it four then go to the two then go to the five directly under it. Then go to the three. Then go to the six directly under the three. What if we want to go backwards? Six, three. Five, two. Four, one. You can come up with as many progressions as you'd like to using the first six notes of the major scale. That was a one, five, three, six. Now this time let's do that and add two, five, one after the six. One, five, three, six. Two, five. See how that turned around and made it back to the one, and it sounds like it's complete. These are things that I suggest you practice as a beginner guitar, learning your chords and learning the sound of these chords and how they resonate with one another because they're all connected, they're all related to each other. So that's my lesson for today. Make sure you like, subscribe. Stay tuned. Leave a comment. Um, I have more videos coming soon. I hope you enjoy. Thank you.